Yo, yo, what's up, guys? This is Kurz Pike. My friends call me Big C. Back in action today, I'm going to show you how to take any image and turn it into a vector graphic for free. In this case, you'll see here that I'm in Discord, and in particular, I'm in Midjourney, and I'm going to take this graphic here. So I'm going to just go ahead. I'm going to right click on this one as an example. You can use any image if you've created it using AI, like, I don't know, maybe you've used SDXL or you've used dolly 3 or you've got mid journey whatever just grab an image or something on your computer now let's go over here to google chrome and you're going to see here that i'm on a website called vectorizer.com this is free to use and i can't i can't uh, emphasize that enough this is a free tool so for those of you that want to create like perfect thumbnails or you want to create animated videos and you've got pictures you want to turn them into vectors here's how you do it you go to vectorizer.com you don't even have to log in I'm going to go ahead and grab that image that I just downloaded there. So you'll see it right here on my uh, desktop here. You'll notice here it's a PNG file. I'm going to drag and drop that and just let it go right here. Poof. You'll see here it uploads and it says, okay, uploading, converting, and now I'm going to download it. Now keep in mind it does the best job with PNG files, but if it's a JPEG file, it also works. It's just not quite as good. So you may want to convert from PNG to JPEG, just something to think about. Now you'll see here over top of it, it says SVG. That means scalable vector graphic. That means it's vectorized. Now I'm gonna click on download. It's gonna go into my little download folder. I'm gonna click on this over here. And then now let's open it up. So I'm gonna open it and you'll see here now it says Curtis Pike Pixar French Bulldog dot SVG. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna open up my Adobe Illustrator and I've already got an example here open of this English Bulldog, but let's go with a French Bulldog. I'm going to grab that .svg, I'm going to drag and drop it into Adobe Illustrator. If you don't have Adobe Illustrator, there are lots of other programs out there. Some of them are free that you can go ahead and use and just go ahead and start manipulating the vector graphic. Now, why is that important? Because we took an image, or in this case, an AI image, and we turned it into a vector. And look at this. When I hover over top of this, these are all vectorized now. So I can make minute changes. So if I don't like the color of... Let's say this bulldog's eye, I don't know, maybe I want that to be some sort of crazy dark light blue. I don't know, I'm just having some fun here. Look at that, I just went ahead and did it, it was that quick. When we click on the layers over here, when I drill down into it, you're going to see here that there's hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of layers with all of the little dots and the doodads here, you can make minute changes to it. So if I wanted to change the color of his ears, let's go ahead and have some fun with that. Maybe he has a bright red piece inside his ear. Again, I'm just having some fun, but look at that. In just seconds, we took a picture, turned it into a vector graphic. We can manipulate it now as we see fit. There are so many things you can do with this. This is free and it's awesome. Links in the description below. Leave a comment. Thanks for watching.